Welcome to Salesforce Predator. In this channel, we discuss about various concepts and technologies in Salesforce. In this video series, we are discussing about Process Builder. In today's video, we'll see how we can send email alerts using processes. We have a problem statement with us. So, we need to send an email to user when case status changes to escalated. Okay. So, we'll go to our Salesforce org and First of all, we'll create an email alerts. Okay, so we'll look for email alerts. We'll click on new email alert. And for description, we'll provide case escalation email. Okay. For object, we need to select case object. And we need to select one email template also okay so let's check if we have email template associated to case in org already so we do have an email template uh, escalated case notification right so we'll select this email template only for recipient type we'll keep user as a recipient type and we'll select our user and from email address we'll keep it as current users email address okay We'll click on save. So we have created a email alert. Now, uh, next thing is we need to create a process builder. So we'll go and search for process builder in setup. We'll click on new process builder and for process name we'll name it as send email on case escalation okay we'll start the process when a record changes and we'll click on save next thing is we need to select object on which this process will run so we'll select object and it has to be case and uh, we'll start the process when record is created or edited because we have to send email notification when status of an existing case changes to escalated okay so we'll save these details and next thing is we need to add criteria okay so we'll uh, specify criteria name status updated to escalation or we can just specify status is escalation we'll keep criteria for executing actions as conditions are met and uh, we'll specify conditions here we'll just add a null check is null equal to false we'll again select case status and equals to it should be escalated okay and we'll keep all conditions are met so next step is we need to add actions so we'll click on add action and for action type we have to select email alerts because we want to send email when status got escalated so for action name we'll specify send an email and we need to find our email alert so what's name of our email alert it is case escalation email we'll search for email alert yeah so we, this email alert is available we'll select this and we'll click on save okay so we have created a process builder we have selected object as case and uh, we have specified the criteria over here and we have specified the action also okay so we'll just activate our process and we'll confirm this so our process got activated now we'll go to a case record and try to modify it and we'll see whether this process is working properly or not okay so we'll go to case tab 
simultaneously will open our gmail account so that we can verify whether we are receiving an email or not okay so i'll go to a case record so we need to go to other case record the status is not escalated yeah this one so what i'll do is i'll click on edit and change the status to escalated and we'll click on save so let's refresh our email oh so we got the email right so this was the email template which we selected while creating email alert and we have information case subject case number over here right so this is similar to the case which we updated okay so that's how we create an email alert and uh, use in a process so that we can send emails uh, based on certain criteria okay if you have any questions you can write it down in the comment section don't forget to subscribe this channel thank you